Hey, this is Professor Game, where we interview successful practitioners of games, gamification, and game thinking who bring us the best of their experiences to get ideas, insights, and inspiration that help us in the process of getting our students to learn what we teach. And I am Rob Alvarez. I'm the founder of Professor Game and professor of gamification and games-based solutions at IE Business School, EFMD, EBS University, and many other places around the world. And if this content is for you, then please go ahead and subscribe to our email list for free at professorgame.com slash subscribe. Hey, Engagers, welcome back to another episode of the Professor Game Podcast. And we have today a special episode. I know we've been doing plenty of these lately. You know, I've been sharing... Pers- I mean, lately, to be honest, it's it's been more and more of these personal updates Ever since I think that the first, you know, the first season where this started was when I got my new job back then <laughs> at Arnhack. Of course, very recently with the arrival of Lara, our baby daughter, and some others here and there as well. So maybe keeping up with this tradition of sharing, you know, those who know me personally might, or probably before the podcast, you might think, you know, Rob is not the kind of person to be sharing so much personal information here. But, you know, I've, I've found it very, very nice to, to have a, 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 a group, a tribe, a clan like all of you, like the Engagers, to share some of, of my life's experiences and some of the updates, the important, the significant big updates when they come into my life. So that's why, why I'm here. That's why I am making this special episode. Today we have... Today we're not going to have any guests, but I will be sharing some very important updates for me and hopefully as well for this podcast and in general for the whole Professor Game community. So as you know, I already mentioned this with our baby. Um, There's also been, to be honest and, and completely excited about this, there's been an explosive growth for me in things like teaching, especially gamification with workshops and gamification as well. Also on consulting uh, to a certain level as well, this was something I was being very, very careful about. I was just taking a very select small group of clients in general because my time is very, very limited, as you can expect, having a full-time job, you know, also teaching, having this podcast, doing, speaking around the world. There, There's many things that were happening, so I didn't really have time to commit fully to consulting gigs. It was being very, very limited But given all of these circumstances in my life, of course, uh, here in Spain, if you didn't know, (laughs) parental leave is what some of you would consider a little bit crazy, and I'm crazy happy about it. It was 16 weeks, so almost four months of parental leave for mothers and for fathers just as well. You know, I could have taken it in different capacities, but I decided to dedicate it fully so I could really spend time with Lara at those times. Of course, some... Not completely sleepless nights because she's been an absolute saint in that sense. She sleeps really, really well in most cases. But some of those nights where, of course, you do wake up and you don't have much to do because they always tell you, you know, have the lights as off as possible, not too many sounds. So most of what you have is you're there with your mind thinking about things. And of course, as I was mentioning, you know, life was getting very, very hectic for me. There were many things happening, more and more teaching. In fact, during my parental leave, I did do, I did continue to do some teaching and I've, there's been an explosive growth for this. It's, it's been amazing. It's been super exciting, very fulfilling as well. So given all of this, I have decided to make a pause to my normal, quote unquote here, <laughs> professional career, which is currently at Ironhack, which I can't say enough good things about at least all of the people that I work with at Ironhack, my team of in product, my team at B2B. I mean, that it's been an amazing experience. It's been super fulfilling. And I also have to say that this decision of making this pause has been fully supported by every single person I've discussed this with. You know, there's been a lot of support in that sense. Everybody has understood these circumstances perfectly, and they're actually happy, at least for me. You know, they're kind of a little bit sad as well that I'll be leaving, at least temporarily for sure, uh, many of these teams. Um, But, you know, it is a decision that I had to make. This is, at least in my view, and from what I've seen, this is the right time to do something like this. Um, I will now be dedicating 
my full efforts to gamification and teach my full professional efforts, <laughs> of course, this means definitely that I'll be dedicating more time to this. I'll be bringing new pro projects, potentially new services for you engagers, and so much more. Hopefully, this will be an opportunity for us to interact more, to you know, be able to do things together, to you know, to to do a lot more of what we've been doing, but with a lot more focus. You know, I won't be thinking about too many things. I'll be having a lot more focus for both my students, uh, where I'm doing teaching and workshops, and some of the consulting, and of course, definitely this podcast and you engagers as a community. So of course, if you have anything in mind that you would like or need my help on, now I am a lot more available for these kinds of things. So feel free to reach out. The best way to do this and to keep up with any more updates in that sense is to go, as you have heard me a million times say, is to go to professorgame.com slash subscribe. That is our free email list and I'll be dedicating an increasing amount of time and attention to this in the coming weeks and the coming months. As you can imagine, this is a very exciting time for me for many reasons, you know, for get, dedicating a lot more to gamification, which you can hopefully tell by the way I talk about. This is definitely a life passion of mine. I think many things can be done, can be achieved, especially in education, which as you know, is my main focus has, and has been for the past decade. There is so much potential. There are so many things that we can do that we can understand in different ways you know, the motivation of people, why people do things. So there is definitely a lot there. Of course, having a little bit more time to dedicate to Lara, to my daughter, is something that is going to be absolutely exciting. Understanding that now, you know, the balance that I'll need to make is a lot more, makes a lot more sense where I'll be, you know, doing these things in gamification, doing my teaching and having Lara. There is definitely going to be a lot more space than I would have if this decision hadn't been made. And... You know, in general, I don't know if, if, if you know this, but entrepreneurship used to be my big topic at some point. I, I, I haven't discussed this much in the podcast, um, but I used to conduct a show, a, a radio show on entrepreneurship back in the day, back home in Venezuela. This was um, this was in Spanish. Of course, it was with local entrepreneurs. It was a very small radio station at the time. I had its ups and downs. Um, I did a plenty of research and reading on the subject as well. In fact... Um, I still listen to, you know, a, a significant portion of what I listen to in podcast is nowadays is still dedicated to this subject. So taking this on on myself, you know, not just as a side project, which was what it has been up until now, up until in fact, up until today, today is when I start formally as not being or taking this pause, this professional pause at Arnhack. So it is today, today I am formally becoming an entrepreneur in many different capacities and there's certainly a lot more to come. Perhaps we will have more special episodes in the future to discuss details, but at this point what I wanted to share and what I wanted you to focus on is this huge milestone with you here. This will hopefully be a milestone not just for me personally and professionally, but definitely for Professor Game, the podcast the community of engagers and everything that we offer today and that we will offer in the future. So thank you. Thanks again for your continuing support to this podcast, to this community. Let's take gamification and games-based solutions in general and game thinking to a new level together. Let's do this. Let's go. And I will see you there. <laughs>